Hey everybody, we are back in Cradle Humanity. This is still a preview version, so it's not final. What you see may change. Keep that in mind. All those disclaimers. So we're back in the Asgard. Look at this view. So this is from the bridge of the Asgard. You can see Earth. You got some Osaka destroyers and other ships there. This is really an awesome view. Even a station down there. So what we're going to do today is a little different. So my last video, I piloted this uh, Asgard ship and, and blew some stuff up. Now we're going to see how the AI does against some targets. Does it know how to use the main super weapon? We'll find out. All right, so we've entered a Xenon sector. Let's pause it real quick. We have two Ks in here. What our Asgard pilot can do against the K. Oh, it fired and destroyed at one shot the K. Very interesting. I thought it was going to miss there. I really did. I didn't think it was going to be able to hit it. But the AI hit the K. Very cool. It did not fire on any of the other ships. Okay, let's have a little fun with the split now. We'll take the Asgard up against a Raptor. And then, you know, maybe a Rattlesnake. Oh, there we go. It's lining up. There it is. Oh, it did not destroy it. And oddly enough, it's not firing its main batteries either. Well, we gotta see what happened. Oh, it barely survived. Oh, and there it is. Finally shot it and destroyed it. Very cool. So it did eventually do it, although it never really used its main battery batteries for some reason, and I don't quite know why. All right, we're gonna try to engage a rattlesnake here and see how that goes. The Asgard kind of tough to see in the sun over there but it's going right for it and then there's the main shot oh just that did not last long <laughs> mm. so yeah if uh if the sh <laughs> if the pilot lines you 
the target up, it's pretty good at hitting it. We did see that the Raptor survived. I don't know if that's because it missed a little or if the Raptor just had too much shield and hull. But uh, it'll still one-shot most things. And the, But the AI does not seem to use any of it, its main batteries, at least against the capital ship. Those aren't ones you can uh, give orders to It look in, in the weapon grouping either. So we destroyed a K, a Raptor, and a Rattlesnake. And again, this is just to experiment with the AI. This one, obviously, the uh, it wouldn't be so easy if these ships had a lot of uh, cover or if there were several destroyers. I picked on this lone rattlesnake, which I should be able, this, the Asgard should win. No problem. It's a big gun. It's very slow. And if it hits something smaller, it's going to destroy it. Now, if there are several things fire, if there are several destroyers and a lot of uh, smaller ships, the, there are no small turrets on this Asgard, so it'll get eaten up eventually. And there's a very long cooldown on that we on the primary weapon, so it is not invincible. Now, how many of these will the AI field? I would imagine one, I uh, maybe two. I can't see the AI building too many or being allowed to. But the player, I mean, knock yourself out, have fun. You could build a bunch of them, but like it, it is tough to line it up because the ship is so slow. So and the cooldown is so long. So those are the drawbacks. Anyway, hope you found this video fun too. These are kind of fun to make. So I'll see you later.